And we're going to work on our the ghettos are in so the you take a look at what's going on where you have pockets of, of areas of land where you have the inner cities and you have so many things, so many problems, so many horrible, horrible problems. The violence, the death, the lack of education, no jobs. We're going to work with the African-American community and we're going to solve the problem of the inner city. We're going to solve the problem. David, um, why, why does he continue to do this, and why aren't his advisors educating him? Could they not know any better as well? I mean, what, what's going on here? I, I see three problems, Don. One is, is that it, to the extent that Donald Trump is trying to do outreach to African-American voters, it's too little, too late. In our new Washington Post poll, uh, Hillary Clinton is plus 81 among black voters. Uh, you know, he's, he's just not going to catch up in this regard uh, a week and a half out. Another problem is the language he uses. You know, people are going to come after me on Twitter and say this is being politically correct. But look, a part of being able to talk to a slice of the electorate is being able to speak their language at least a little bit. People don't use the word ghetto anymore in this context. Um, you know, just like you don't use the word Negro anymore or the word Oriental anymore. It's not a matter of political correctness. It's a matter of being uh, sort of uh, polite and respectful and also understanding where the discussion has gone. And lastly, uh, it's that on policy, right? He gave a speech yesterday where he talked about his New Deal for Black America, which I don't think fully resonates with the black electorate, but at least was an earnest attempt. But then he wound up stepping on that message again today and, be, and being all over the place and not being able to drive that home. As Mark said, uh, he has a tough time staying on message. In terms of his advisors, I, I, I couldn't hazard a guess, Don. They, they, this is a broader problem for Republicans writ large, not just the Donald Trump campaign. I, the ghettos was just, I... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>